Hey guys, I've had a lot of people message me about um, my continental knitting on this project. This is a headband. Um, I'm test knitting for Hawk and Chain. Um, so, yeah, I, I've not always knitted continental, but I did force myself last year to learn because I saw how much faster it was. And um, it makes projects like this just so much quicker. Um, this is, you know, just stockinette. Nothing but, nothing but knits, which is when the Continental comes in handy. So, yeah, I essentially just sat down and on a project like this and forced myself to learn how to knit like this. And I'm so glad I did. Oops. And I still need to practice my purl stitches. I did find a way that's a lot faster. Um, and I uploaded that video to my Instagram TV channel. And even since that video, I've tweaked it a little bit and I still need to, oh my goodness, I still need to actually upload a video for that. So yeah, tell me if you're a continental knitter for everything, for specific projects, do you throw your yarn? I think it's super fascinating how everyone knits just a little bit differently. So I think it makes total sense for knit stitches. It is tricky with the purl stitches. And oops, whoa. Ooh. For example, get my knitting needle. So these are itty bitty baby leg warmers. Let me move my lighting is getting a little too much. So these are teeny tiny baby leg warmers. And I definitely prefer to just knit English when I have this many double point needles going on and when I have pearls happening. So, so for me, it just depends on the project. Sorry, my phone keeps slipping. Ugh, someday I'll have a better setup. tripod or something. So thanks for sticking with me through my hacks as I just kind of figure out what I'm doing. Oops. All right. Well, I think you get the point. I just kind of change it up as I go. Depending on the project affects how I knit. Thanks for tuning in.